There's the mid range hunter. I like that start. Dude. A sly smile yeah. appears on Hunter Race's face. This it just feels like Hunter Race's event so far. When you have a draw like that, I mean, nothing really to be ashamed about it. You put, you brought this deck specifically to curve out and pressure the decks that are greedy, like Taunt Druid, which takes a while to get set up. Dilo has the, the wild growth, but he needs a little bit more. And gosh, Hunter Race has that Houndmaster. Just needs any kind of play that's strong on turn three, and he has the perfect one, two, three, four. Jasper Spellstone, finding that early removal is pretty key. Ooh, Death Star Rexar though. I mean, that could be a much different way. Okay, so not necessarily the best aggressive tools here. Um, there can be some really good stuff with Liquid Membrane because Druid is very target removal focused mm -hmm. with um, Jasper Spellstone and Swipe. Does end up picking the plus health, which kind of functions similarly anyways, just giving a lot of resilience. And, and, and this makes sense too, given the fact that Hunter Ace might need to be trading anyway um, into like a board with Oak and Summons. Mm -hmm. So yeah, makes makes the most sense here. Well, this is sort of where that hybrid Hunter starts looking not so great, is when the hybrid aspect of it messes up your opening how, hand, right? How is it hybrid? Because you run minion mid-range, yeah. but also secrets and TJ. and Lesser Emerald Spellstone. So if you have Lesser Emerald Spellstone and early minions, it doesn't work. Just if you have early minions and secrets, it doesn't <laughs> work. Let's just call it like it is. It's Minion Hunter. There's a lot of spells. Yeah, but it's like the first half of his deck is just min he, he wants to curve into minions. 19 spells, Dan. Yeah. That's a lot. And, and a death knight, so so. And a death knight. It's <laughs> a so ten. So minions. ten minions. Yeah. No, <laughs> because there's eagle horn bows. There's only eight minions. <laughs> it's spell hunter with some minions. Yeah. So minion spell hunter. AKA, <laughs> AKA a hunter deck. AKA hybrid hunter. AKA hunter aces hunter deck. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> I just want to see the title published by those articles when they post in the deck list. Hunter Aces, Minion Spell, Hunter Deck. <laughs> Make it happen, Old Guardian. Stilo kind of has to remove some of these minions. Doesn't want to take too much damage. Knows he's uh, under threat of Houndmaster. Parts ways with a swipe. Well, only one rule play to go for here. But this is the most important turn. I think starting from turn four onwards is when the pressure really gets um, going for this deck because there's then the threat of Spellstone starts being in the looming back of uh, Stilo's mind here. Yeah. And this, he, he can't deal with Spellstone. You know, this deck doesn't run Spreading Plague. It doesn't have the Death Knight to stall and take down those um, those wolves systematically. Mm -hmm. In fact, Stilo is playing super greed. Double Dragon Hatcher, two Sleepy Dragons, two Promoto Drakes. He can't play any of those cards. Even if he drew like three extra, there, there's a high chance that he has a dead hand. Yeah, and he has already drawn a Witching Hour and a Hadronox, which are effectively useless. Even Dragon Hatcher can sometimes be a liability in the opening hand because you need a lot of ramp to make that really useful. Honoris does have a deadly shot in his deck. That's about his only way to push through big stuff. But a lot of times you get to that stage of the game, you're just going over the top with kill commands and trying to push him down with your hero power. So. Mm -hmm. And look at Hunter Ace's next turn. He has tracking, which can pick up that spell stone with two secrets to buff him up. And that's if this board gets removed. Yeah, I, I just think Stilo needs to stall for time. Very much so. If the game goes to the late, late stages, he is heavily favored. But, you know, Hunter Ace's deck is designed to pressure and, and punish those decks with minions and spells. Yeah. <laughs> Looking for. There it is. Spellstone is the juice right now. Dan. It is the juice, but it's not loose. Loosey juicy. I mean, you can play those double spells. Oh, sorry, double <laughs> double secrets, which are spells. It's a secret spell minion hunter deck. Secret spell minion hunter weapon death knight hunter deck. 
Ooh, I like that. AKA Hybrid Hunter. We're just going full circle, Dan. Oh, AKA Hunter Aces, Minion oh, Spell, Secret, Death Knight, weapon, weapon, Death Knight, Hunter Deck. Hunter Deck. It's absolutely right. Yep. The, the thing is, with these um, traps, you know, you're not afraid of them being low value either. First of all, they pump your spell stone. But second of all, your opponent's not getting through his 3-6. In fact, your opponent's not doing anything. He's, he's essentially yeah. passing. And Hunter Ace just gives a little <laughs> smile again. He knows he's out for blood right now. Oh, yeah. Uh, he's pushing three this turn, which means Stila is going down to 15. Right. And he's got 16 damage on board. And the concede. 2-0, Hunter Ace is destroying Stilo.